Cutscene. Feel as though my powers are almost at their peak. The souls within me burn with a dreadful fire that threatens to consume me. I must exercise the utmost care from here on in, or find myself succumbing to Asylum's dark allure. Short cutscene. So yeah, we're not going to be able to do everything in here because there is some swimming in the lava that happens. But as soon as we get 8 meter, uh, we can go to the last fire temple. But I don't want to go to the next fire temple until we're close to 9 meter. So that way we can uh, really clear it when we get there, because we can get the Calabash. Otherwise, we'll have to go back and do a lot of refights. But it might just be what what has to happen. Ducks. Is that it? Just that one pathway? So this is another asylum level? So there's another retractor in here. Oh, dude, was there no accumulator for us to get? I guess not. Hmm. That shadow got me. Alright, there's a lot going on here at the entrance. Um, let's 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 play around with it. Oh, it's like where is this? There we go. Cat up! How many cattle do we have? 94. We almost got another health bar. So after uh, after we do what we want in this place... Oh, I could have just hopped on here. No. No. I wasn't looking. Oh, there's like three pathways here. I hope these elevators aren't just like pointless. Okay, so the elevators took us up here. But that's it. Okay. Pathway there. I thought I saw an engineer's key thing there, but I guess not.
Oh, there's chainsaw guys down below. I remember this room. Is it just the one? YOLO. It was not just the one. I think we still we still kill them though. Are we legends? Alright, it helps when they just walk. Very useful. Thank you, chainsaw guy. Playing first person mode? Oh, we haven't gotten to get a good look at these guys. So that's a that's a new enemy for the remaster. They have a name, I forget what they're called. Oh, so it's just that door down here, which is locked. We'll get it eventually. Dude. the whatever you want to call it yet though oh that's big that's a that's a warp for when we die now Game's hard. Oh no, I didn't have to reload. Can't dodge at that close range. New strat. Gotcha. Who needs a shadow gun? All right, so I gotta remember, there's still a lot of stuff at the beginning I haven't done. Go be behind locked doors. All right. Oh, my God.
No! Oh, he's gonna be right here. <laughs> the one dude sniping from downtown. Yeah, I wish I could use the live side guns here. Come on. Leave me alone. All right, a lot of locked doors. I don't think we're going to be able to access a lot of it until we can swim in lava, unfortunately. No, there's got to be stuff we can do here without that, though. We have to be able to, like... Get, may probably get a uh, probably get the retractor. Dude, screw that guy. Alright. Got it. We got a Dark Soul. Got it. Oh god. No. Hundred two. I didn't notice when I got a hundred. No, I clicked the stick. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> They're so aggressive. There was another one. All right, so yeah, Fongo is really good against them. It like stuns them, which I didn't think. I didn't think you that happened in this difficulty. Maybe it's like just these guys? Oh, come on.
All this and it's still hook guys. Alright, can't get up there. Oh, I oh, I remember this. So there's a really obnoxious um, Cato to get right there. Luckily, save states, but... Jeez. Man, this guys really are just tanky as hell. Is there like a... Alright, alright, we're, we're gonna go up here first. There's a dude up there. Oh no. We did not think. Totally the right jump. It's just a, it's a tough jump. The squeakiness here is definitely more intense than it needs to be. Um, I forget if we want to go this way. So many paths, man. Oh, this is the retractor room. All right, we'll come back here. Good to know. Dude, absolutely murdered. All right, this one, pretty easy. Yeah, that's squeaking, right? I just, I don't know why they thought that was a good idea. All right, this and this one kind of sucks, but safe states are our friends. Yep. I don't know why they felt like this this needed to exist. Hell yeah. All right. Now do we explore the bottom or the top? I say the top. Sorry, Jared. Squeakiness is back. I feel like it's going to be back at least one more time after this. So you got to get the retractor. Wouldn't be as bad if I wasn't wearing headphones. Am I just supposed to drop down? Do I jump? All right, it's against the wall.
it's actually kind of funny, but like it's like comically bad. Yeah. <laughs> Is this supposed to be useful? Can I hide from the chainsaw guys on there? Okay. All right, so it's, yeah, squeaky, squeaky time. One more, one more time. It's like they did it on purpose, right? I was like, all right, find me the most obnoxious squeaking sound, please. And they had a little contest. And they were like, I got it. Oh, it's going to be Seraph here. We're going to fight another one of those, like, mini bosses. Oh, come on. Oh, there's two of them. I think we get the, the violator out. I think we go we go violator shield. Where are you at? Oh, we ran out of ammo for that, too. What? Freaking boss characters. We got cooked by the regular guy. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, all right, I'm not using the shield the way I should be. Oh 
Oh my god, what am I doing? Did we kill him? We get him? We got him? Holy hell. Dude, not having the gun in my right hand felt so weird. <gasps> we didn't! Dude, come on. There we go. Get the hell out of here. And that's okay, that's, that's where we went down to start that whole journey. That's where we ended up. Yes. And we'll go over there. I'm pretty sure that's where we start. But that'll mean we've we've gotten everything we can get here. Yeah, yeah, pretty sure that's where we start. Yeah, so we gotta go back to the beginning. To here. All right. So we can either go down that path or that path. Let's do this one. Too strong. Holy crap, how do we do that? Yeah, yeah, you know we're dead there. You know we're dead there. I don't think we'll be... I think we'll have to come back for that. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, we'll be running back. Unbelievable. Oh, 
Do I violate or anything? Damn, Alabama. Nope. Oh, we, that was probably our last shot. So strong now. All right, we're not that strong. Don't go crazy. First person soul. Oh, that's just that's just that. Okay. Oh, that's all that was. Okay. I guess it's a shortcut, so you don't have to take the elevator up. Let's make sure. Nothing there. Looks good. Both doors locked. Yes. Great. Come, let's come back for the doors. We'll, we'll take this path. Like you said, I'm so sorry. All right, it's just another locked door, another shortcut. So not not really. This is just that other. Yep, we still haven't been able to get there. All right, so that was the path, and now we have the two doors. What? <laughs> Hell yeah. Pick the right door first. Wait, there, there wasn't anything there, was there? Felt too, too easy. Is that like a ceiling? No, all right. All right. Oh, there he is. That was too much. I think I actually had some violator ammo too. That's what I should have used.
Accidental joystick click, man. With absolutely nothing left. No health, no voodoo, magic pixel. Ooh, level eight. Level eight. Ah, uh, I still can't get that. Twenty out of thirty. Oh, Cato. It's only five. Only five souls we've gotten. But I'm pretty sure that's all the souls we can get here. Yep, yep, I was right. So we could, we could go to the Temple of Blood, but we're gonna open another schism. So we're going to the prison now. Oh, he almost fell in. Unbelievable. I believe it's the... Oh, no, it's not the prison. We're going to the... We could... Well, we could go to the prison. I don't know, Jared. Prison or apartment complex? Max 250 violator ammo. Apartments? All right, we'll go to the apartments. That stage is way creepier now. They like redid a lot of the textures and everything. It's super creepy. Yes, there are. Uh, let's, there's a few cattle we can get here. We'll just get those and we'll go to the apartments. Oh no, more squeakies. But why? Is there just going to be nothing in each of these little pits? That's kind of disappointing. All right, so we got to go down both sides. But of course, I have to check all of them. Because, like, one of them might have it. Oh, 
28 out of 37. I don't think we've been in the fifth altar room. There's probably some in there. Oh, it's... Those squeakies move faster. Yeah, we haven't been up there yet. Just the one. Oh wait, is this... I think there's a cheat, a secret here. I'm even thinking of another place where you like fall down a, a shaft with a bunch of blades. Yeah. Oh, come on. I can't die. Not yet. We've come too far. Just the dudes manning the control room with, with hook hands. I guess they actually have hands. They're just holding hooks. Why are there so many... So many rooms. So many rooms and paths. This room is literally nothing. Two fifty max ammo. Let's go. So good. Oh, one more. Boom. Boom. Got him. So we just have to fall down here, and I think it's another cheat. Oh, yeah. Yep. I remember that. <laughs> Alright, send me back. Damn. Okay, apartments. I'd say we should get the, uh, go to Temple of Life and get the extra health bar, but we're not, we're not going to need it in the apartments. There are, like, no enemies in there. So I guess the only uh, the only live side place we're not going to experience during the day is going to be the prison because we're not going to be able to get to the fogometers without. Oh wait, no, wait! I guess we could hit level nine. All right, we're still going for it. Oh, okay. Yeah, that would have been prime spot for a cat that no one would ever see. All right, still kind of. I guess it's still kind of rough here without the uh, flashlight. Oh, 
But we'll get it. Yeah, this game, I love this game. Um, the N64 version is great. Like, you know, one of my favorites. Played it growing up. Huge fan. But this is the, uh, the remaster, which you can get on Steam. And it adds a ton of new content to the game. So, like, if you want, you know, the original experience, um, you definitely play it on 64. But this is by far the best version of the game. It's really good. Playing it on, yeah, it's really is dark in here. Playing it on N64 will give you like even more of an appreciation for how good the remaster is and like their attention to detail. Here's Johnny. But yeah. I bid you welcome. Enter freely and of your own will. Don't mess with me, little man. Little big man. Little big. Didn't your mama never tell you? It don't matter how big. My mama loves me. She never loved you. My mama kisses me. My mama would never, never, ever kiss you. No, not never, ever kiss you. Come to mama now, baby. Sweet baby, come to mama. All right. So that's the the boss of this area. We got the warp. I think, yeah, we can definitely progress in this level up to, like, the shortcut. Uh, the shortcut will just be activating that elevator. And then when we come back, we'll be able to just take the elevator up. Yeah, it's, it's, <laughs> there's, some, there's some weird stuff in this game. Yeah, it's it's really good. Um, the remaster is available on like I want to say all platforms, like all consoles, Epic, um, Steam, you know, all that stuff. I can definitely get lost. Oh, there are dogs here. Sorry, dogs. I need ammo. Damn, out of ammo. I think we get a flashlight somewhere around here. Uh, good 64 ROM hacks. There's a bunch of Banjo-Kazooie ones, Zelda ones, uh, Mario Kart uh, Amped Up is pretty sick if you like that. Uh, there's Smash Remix, of course. Oh, crap. Alright, got wrecked. It depends on what you like. Um, like, do, do you like Zelda games? Like, do you like the Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask games? Because then there's some really good uh, ROM hacks for you to check out for that. If you like Banjo-Kazooie, highly recommend looking into those. Oh, you love Zelda? Yeah, there's some really good ones. I don't remember the names off the top of my head, but you can definitely find them with, like, some quick Googling. Yes, I see that hole in the ceiling. I'll go back. Okay, empty room. Sorry, I'm shooting for the light <laughs> that the gun gives off. 
Yeah, there's like people have made like essentially entire like sequels to Ocarina of Time. There's some there's some high quality uh, Zelda ROM hacks. And as far as I know, they're like all playable on console. The, the only ROM hacks off the top of my head that are like less likely to be playable on console are the Mario 64 ones. Yeesh. Yeah, like this stuff, not in the original game. They did not waste the, the time and, and space on like all this crazy stuff. Yeah, I mean, me neither, Costco. A lot of... I just really like Super Nintendo and N64 games, like 16-bit. Oh, jeez. This is terrible. Oh, yeah, those were not in the original. I can't just climb back up. Come on, dude. Yeah, there's so many ROM hacks. Like, you can just go live in that era again, basically. Oh, I mean, some of these ROM hacks are long, to be fair. I mean, dude, this remaster, I'm... I'm you know, 13 hours in. Granted, I'm playing, like, the new hard mode and I'm, like, 100%ing it, but... There are some, uh... Some of the Banjo-Kazooie ROM hacks are just, like, one level. It's just, like, one new level, which is pretty cool. I don't know. There, there's a lot of good stuff out there if you, if you just... If you look for it. There are GoldenEye... Uh, GoldenEye ROM hacks... There's a couple good ones. Oh. Yeah, there's just, there's a lot of good stuff out there. Uh, what's with the birdhouse? Anyone else feel like there's a hole in the floor here? Oh, come on! No! <laughs> I got shredded. Oh, no. I, you know, that hallway was just too long and straight. You knew there was going to be something there. My name is Legion. Yeah, a long time ago I did a, a ROM hack stream. Just like 12 hours of different ROM hacks. There was this one Ocarina hack where uh, it was a roguelike and you just kept playing this like you know, randomly generated level with different enemies and stuff, and you upgrade your equipment. Definitely a cool concept. Alright, I think we're about back... Dude, that guy crushed us. Can I get up there? No. Nope. 
We're definitely like up a floor or two though at this point. Yeah, you definitely couldn't see outside in the original. Yeah, this level got expanded for sure. All this like stuff on the wall, all the creepy stuff. Well, we don't need help now. At some point we find something that turns the lights on. It like turns the power on in the building. And it lets us use the elevator. There it is. And the good Lord said, Let there be light. We did it. Oh my god, come on, man. That's kind of cool. In the original, after the cutscene, you either fight the boss or you just don't see them until you fight them. So it's cool that they, like, are present throughout the level. Oh, that's just a lump in the floor. And we're here now. Feel like there's more for us here. Oh, we're max violator ammo. Look at us. I think this puts us out on the other side. That's where we got jumped. I don't know, maybe. Maybe we can just take the elevator. Yeah, we're really just circling back at this point. Whoops. through one place that's where we came from we haven't been here maybe this is the path of the flashlight Can I turn on the power Still not a lot of lights. Yikes. Sweet Jesus. Oh, yep. Yeah, there it is. Flashlight.
Very useful now. Thank you, game. Nothing up here. How many, uh... This is very good. Thirteen cattle left? Alright, so there's the... That one balcony section... We were on. I just don't know if you could get to the other section. You supposed to jump? Damn. Oh, I should have saved. Big dummy. I gotta wait for it to come back down. Did we go? He did go the other way. Made it. No. Nice. Sweet pixel fog. I wonder... We <laughs> will not be going that way first. Oh, I think this is actually the way to the boss. Okay. We got two. One more. One more and we can get a second violator. All right, all right, it's a circle. Unbelievable. Yeah, that's the way of the boss. And we'll just We'll just get pwned. Oh, we can't climb up there. Okay. We can't go there because we're not dead. We can't climb up that. Convenient. So we could use one accumulator right now to increase our max violator ammo, or we wait until we get one more, and then we can uh, get a second violator. I lean towards waiting for one more. All right, now we can go to that that bad floor spot. Oh, yeah. All right. Hopefully there's seven Caddo up there. I don't really... I think we pretty much explored what we could. It feels like we went everywhere. Uh, 
Except for this, maybe. No, we went here, right? Yeah. Yeah, I feel like I feel like we we explored. So yeah, fingers crossed that there are five five cattle waiting for us. Is this just an empty room? That's where we just were. Alright, alright, alright. Where do we want to go?